Oh no, Martha! Martha! Oh crap! How did you get in here? You spawned in here, didn't you? Martha! Martha, are you okay? Where's Martha Jr? Where's Martha Jr? Oh no! Martha, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry to tell you this, but your daughter... Your daughter was most likely eaten by that wolf. He spawned into our garden and ate Martha Jr. I'm so sorry. Do I have any eggs? Let's see if we can... No, okay. Hang on, Martha Jr. This is too tragic. I can't, I can't leave you alone in the garden like this. Come on, eggs. Come on. Come on. Really? Oh no, no, not like that was a whole thing of eggs. Okay, here's more eggs. Oh, there you go. Welcome, Martha Jr. the second. Yes, you. Your name is Martha Jr. the second, and you have a solemn purpose in life. It is to live in here and eat the bugs that try to eat our garden. This is your mother, Martha. She recently suffered the loss of Martha Jr. the first. I, I trust that you will, yes, attend to her. Go to her side. Help her through this phase of mourning. I think they'll be all right. What a tragic outcome. A wolf spawning straight into our garden and consuming a beautiful little critter that has been with us for so long. It's very sad, very, very sad. Ah, well, there are there are some, some happy notes though. There's some good stuff that's been going down. In fact, I have quite a bit to show you guys. Like this, do you see this? Oh, oh, oh. And did you see that? Did you see that? Let me show it off again. Our shiny armor. And now we have shiny tools. Check this out. They're meteor tools. Yeah, 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 yeah. Gonna hit you with the sacks. Yeah. And see how everything's glowing? Well, it turns out that's the magnetic ability of this. See, watch if I try to throw these seeds away. They just swirl around and pop right back into my inventory. Doesn't matter how many I throw. Boom! It's because I'm magnetic now. Magnetic! All right. Uh, that's way too bad about... Oh, it's already night. Look at this. That's too bad about the, the chickens. Poor Martha Jr. And also, did you see how quickly all of that zoomed right into our inventory? It makes gardening so much easier. Which is a good thing, because we need this wheat. Hello, Martha Jr. the second. Indeed. We need this wheat because... Nope, you can't have it. You're just a baby. You can't have these seeds. We need... Okay. Moon is rising. Monsters are spawning. Not right now, guys. I'm going to go nap. I don't want involved in this crazy non monster nonsense. There have been so many creeper explosions around the staff lounge lately. It has just been ridiculous. I mean, ridiculous. Oh, I left the doors wide open, too. Well, that was smart. All right, let's get my new fancy axe. Look at that, look at my glowing axe. It also has the magnetic abilities. Oh, hey, Lily. Hi, guys. See, look, creeper damage. Oh, hi, Mr. Firefly. Yes, you're flying right in my face, aren't you? Uh-huh, oh, oh, oh. Wow, he died right in my wall. But this is where a creeper exploded yet again. Hello, Lily, yes, I know. Lily's saying, hey, come check out the new library. Do you guys like it? It's still a work in progress. We're building the bookshelves. We have plenty of paper, and we have a ton of sugar canes. In fact, I need to put these sugar canes away. I recently harvested some from our awesome sugar cane slash reed farm that we've got going. Yes, Lily, you're pointing out that the creeper did explode the door off the hinges there. It was quite rude, I agree. But right here... We're going to put an enchanting table, and it's going to be surrounded by books, and it's going to be pretty cool. I'm still working on it. We are held back by one factor when it comes to these bookshelves, though. We have plenty of wood, we have plenty of paper, we don't have enough leather. We don't have enough leather, and we don't have enough, um, well, I'll show you. Let me see. We've got quite a bit of wool. Let's see, I need to get an apple. Good morning, sun. How are we doing on creepers? Any creepers? Okay, we're good. We've had so many creepers. I've thought about getting a cat, because I've seen cats show up over in this garden area, but I don't think Mo Creatures cats keep creepers away. In fact, they're they're very high maintenance. They need like food in a food bowl, they need a bed to sleep in, they need to have a litter box, and that litter box, when it's dirty, actually attracts creepers. 
So that would have had the opposite effect that we wanted if we got the Mo Creatures cats. So at some point, because we do need a security detail, because I'm getting sick and tired of having all of our stuff blown up, we're going to have to go find a garden, or a garden, a jungle, and bring back an ocelot. Because then we can have ocelots, two ocelots if possible, so we can have kittens and spread the cats around. They'll be our security force. But first things first, and first things first happen to be sheep. Hello, Mr. Sheep. I need that wool. Why do I need that wool? Because right down here, my friends, we're building a barn! A barn! So we can finally keep our cows, and we can keep our sheep, and we can maybe even tame some horses, and maybe get started on that horse breeding that has to go down. We're going to make this whole area into, like, fields and pasture for our animals. I'm going to try to leave all of the um, flower trees alone, because I can't make them come back. They, once they spawn in, they spawn in, and I can't make them grow back. So we're not going to knock any of those guys down, if possible. I think we might need to... No, we'll be okay there. But we need tons of sheep. In fact, I should go catch some and put a little, like, make a little pen and stick them in here. Because we are building this entire thing out of wool. Why wool, you may ask? Oh, hey, I guess we could go to the spider spawner and collect string from the spider spawner. Because there's quite a bit of string under our house in that, in that labyrinth of webs that we have. But we're building the barn out of wool. Because we cannot build the barn out of clay. The barn, uh or the clay, is a 1.6.1 Minecraft version thing, the hardened clay that you can turn into colors. And we are in 1.5.2 because we are playing with the fossil and archaeology mod and it is not yet updated for higher versions. So no clay. Maybe one day when the fossil and archaeology mod gets updated and we update with it, we'll be able to turn this into a clay barn. But for now, it's going to be a wool barn. So we're just going to have to cope. Just going to have to cope. Though that does mean that we need a lot more wool. Right now we've got a little bit of white wool, and a little bit of red wool, and a little bit of purple wool. And this purple wool, I believe, we are going to change into white wool. Okay. We're going to have to change into white wool, and we can do that with these little white flowers. See? Look! They turn into white dye! I think we could actually do that right here, even. Let's try this out. I knew collecting those flowers was, was a good idea. I know some of you were probably looking at me funny about it. Oh, come on. You're white dye now. I'll figure it out. Maybe we need a crafting table. But yeah, so this is going to be the barn. And we definitely need sheep because we definitely don't have enough wool. This might be a fun time to go on a grand adventure hunting for wool and hunting for sheep. We might start by... Let's start by go getting some fencing and build a little fence. And attracting a couple sheep in it. Like you! See, you've already grown your wool back, assuming you're the same sheep that I collected from a little bit ago. Alright. Drink, drink. Do, 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 do. Let's gather up some sheep. Put them in a little pen. Okay, I need... Um... Yum. Nope, I need sticks. That's what I need. I was trying to remember. There's that. And then we go... Whoops. Hey, Tate. Are you peeking at me? I see you. There's that. I think we're going to need a little bit more than that. There we go. And... There. That should be enough fence. And then, let's see. I've got plenty of wheat to attract the sheep. And even maybe breed them a little bit. Now, here's the white dye. Come on. I really need this to work. It's white dye and purple wool. Come on. Why aren't you working? Dang it. So it looks like we are going to have to just find white sheep. Because I was hoping we could do that. Dang. That sucks. Okay, we're going to temporarily store these things in here. Let's see. Um, keep that. Uh, put that away. Don't need that. Okay, good. Oh, wait. We probably don't need those sticks. Drat. So this is going to be an adventure for wool. And also, when we can find it... Um, hello, Mr. Sheep. I think I'm gonna... When we can find it, leather. I'm so sorry, Mr. Cow! Oh, I need the leather. There was... Did anything drop from that? Just... Just beef. Drat. And why do I need the leather, you ask? Well, we need the leather because we have to... Look at how many levels we have. We want to build that enchanting table. 
and we want to have really high enchantments, but to do that, we need far more bookshelves than we have. I think we had this discussion. It's hard to remember sometimes. All right. Temporary, temporary pen. Watch out, Tate. This is just a temporary small pen. You guys know I'm not one for keeping my animals in small enclosures. I like to give them space to roam and be free. Oops. Eh, come on. Silly flower getting in the way. I guess we didn't bring a gate, did we? Tate? Lily? I know you're curious about what this is and what's going on, but you're not helping right now, darlings. Oh, dang it. We needed more fence. Oh, well, at least now we can go make a gate, too. And then we'll attract those sheep into it. Hello, Mr. Naked Sheep. Maybe even breed them up a little bit. And then I guess we'll just go on a, a mission hunting, exploring a little bit. I'm always- where am I coming over here? What are you doing? You are not invited. No, no, no. Chicken? Why are you- you're not one of my Marthas, are you? Let's make sure the Marthas are where they belong. Okay, there's one Martha. There's baby Martha Jr. Okay, they're doing fine. Lily, are you okay? Yep, yeah, Lily's okay. That's just a random chicken that's wandering around inside here. Tate, are you checking it out? Be nice to that chicken. I've got plenty of beef for you. You don't have to harass the chicken. Okay. Boink. Okay, need those. Uh, now I need wood. <laughs> it really sucks having this little spot blown up. It's like a little parkour area now. Let's see, oak wood planks. Oh! Crafting table right here. Um, I'm trying to remember. I think I do that. And then... That? Ah! I remembered right! Yay! There's that. Oh yeah! I don't know if you guys have seen this. We've updated the storage room a little bit. The archaeology stuff is still in here. Oh, check this out! We've got a claw. We've got another ancient broken sword. We've got quite a few relic scraps and biofossils. Bones, some bone meal, leg bones. Oh! Skulls, rotten flesh. In fact, let's put this one there. And then we've got just kind of some building materials, some extra torches, and some coal. Just tucked here in the storage area. Eventually it'll fill up with more chests and things. Alright, let's get over here. Alright guys, let's go. Gotta finish building that thing and attracting those, those sheep. Because we desperately need more wool. And I can't dye the wool. I could have sworn you could dye the wool. That's, that probably comes with, uh... Oh no, it's gonna be night soon. Come on, Mr. Sheep! Come on! Come on, Mr. Sheep! That's right. Come this way. Am I going the right direction? I am going the right direction. Come on! Oh yeah, you want this. You want to become... My sheep. Oops. Huh. There. <laughs> Lily! Oh well, at least Lily will teleport out of there. Time to pop back inside for a sleep. I kinda wanna make a cookie. We don't have any cocoa beans though. We have so much chocolate. In fact, we haven't even finished the kitchen. <laughs> what? Lily! Lily! Thank you for being a shepherd dog, but that- Oh dang it. Lily is using her shepherd dog talent because I had weed out by picking up a sheep. I forgot she could do that. <laughs> Lily, we'll utilize that skill in just a second. Come in here, Lily. I don't know how to make her put the sheep down. She stole my sheep. That was in the sheep pen. Lily, where'd that sheep go? What did you do with it? She's not telling me. I saw that. I saw you give me that look. Is it out here? Is that it? Is it glitching in the ground? Get out, Mr. Sheep. Miss Sheep. Little bow sheep. Oh no! Okay, Lily, quick! Use your shepherd skill! <gasps> Good job, Lily! Okay, Lily, follow! Wow, I, did, I forgot that I had her be a shepherd dog. Look at that! Lily can just kidnap the sheep for us! That is so cool! That's a wolf! Let's avoid the wolf! Come in here. Come on, Lily! Inside, please. And now, she put it down, just like that. 
And it's a little bit glitchy, a little bit glitchy in the ground. But it's okay. Just like that. So it just takes holding wheat to make her pick it up. Well, we learned something. All right, Tate. All right, Lily, come on. They're just going to have to teleport to me. Oh, Mr. Wolf. Man, that's a dark wolf. Are you going to... Are you going to... You going to leave me alone? Okay, we'll, we'll mutually leave each other alone. I can cope with that. That was a really dark wolf. See, it, it's different from these cute little normal wolves. All right, where's my dogs? There's my dogs. Hey, there's another sheep. Lily, do you want to get this one too? Sheep! It's very important. It's vital that you, you get added to our farm because you're going to help me build the barn. It is on your shoulders, Mr. Derpy Sheep, to carry the burden of building that entire barn out of your wool. All right, let's come this way. Oh, that's right. I need Lily to... Lily? Thank you, Lily. Haha. <laughs> this is so much easier. And look how fast the sheep has grown back its, its wool already. Inside here, Lily. Good girl. Put it down. Just like that. As usual, she put it into the ground a little bit, but it'll be okay. Oh, this is so cool! Are there any- I- you know what? I think we need to take care of that wolf. He's too close to our sheep pen. And I just had a wolf eat Martha Jr. <sighs> Oof. Okay. That was alright. We did it. You know what? I'm getting sick and tired of eating apples. We need to finish that kitchen so that I can have a decent meal. Speaking of which, Lily, you've done an excellent job. I have some disgustingly bloody raw beef in my pockets for you. There you go. All right, let's swap you out, swap you out, put you up here. All right, whoop. All right, come on, Lily, let's find another sheep. This is fun. I forgot Lily was a shepherd dog, just like Tate's a fisher dog. Oh yeah, check this out. This is where I came to gather more meteor chips. And with more meteor chips, I was able to make these awesome tools. Meteor pickaxe, meteor sword, meteor hammer. This is a huge meteor. I'm glad we can build those shields so that we don't have to worry about everything being destroyed when the meteors come. Unfortunately, these cooled off meteors, you don't get quite as many meteor chips from. So we're going to have to be very careful and make sure we save all of the pieces. Because I love this armor. It is a little annoying when I try to throw things out and it just flies back into my inventory. Because when you have a full inventory, it makes it so you can't really chuck anything. But that's okay. Look at all these meteor chips. I'm getting sidetracked. Because I, I feel like I have to come back. It's not like this is going anywhere, though. Oh, but it's so fun. And I thought the meteors were going to be... Kind of, they were one of those things I was okay with having as a random bad thing that could occur from time to time. Disaster and threat of disaster keeps you on your toes, after all. There we go. Okay. Let's move on. Alright, Lily. Let's find more sheep. Actually, I'm going to keep the wheat put away until we find more sheep. Oop. What's this? Little cavern. I think I can make the jump. Nope. Sorry, guys. I misestimate. I like totally didn't estimate that correctly. Where's my dirt? There's my dirt. There we go. Um, well that didn't help me much. That just put me in this little island. There. Okay. Oh, there's a cow. I wonder if we should make a little cow pen too. I really wanted to wait till we had a full barn for that, but I think we need the leather. All right, Lily. Let's do this. Can you pick up a cow, Lily? She has a cow on her head. Hello, Miss Ostrich. Lily, you're so cool. Oh, we lost we lost the interest of the other cow. Come on, I need two cows. Come on, you can do it. Are you scared of the drop-off? Well, there, now you're on the ground. Follow me. Follow me. Nope. Oh, well. We'll come back with Lily. She's such a good girl. Wait, where'd our other sheep go? Dang it, we had two sheep here. Is that it? Oh, he just can't trust anything anymore. I wonder if we should just keep... See, Lily, go get him. That's right, go get him. Good job. Let's just go ahead and put him in here. 
Whoa! You already grew your wool back. That was so fast. Alright, let's try this again. I saw a sheep over here. Maybe it's our sheep and it escaped. Hey you! Hey you! Are you an escapee? Do you belong... Do you belong elsewhere? Oh! Oh! Dang it, Lily! You're supposed to teleport out of there first. Okay, so obviously we need to refine Lily's shepherd herding skills a little bit. This way, this way. Come on, Lily! Come on, girl! Tate, you're getting in the way. Then close. Close, I said. Alright, good. She put the sheep down. Let's make sure she teleports out of there first. Okay, so clearly there's a few drawbacks. It's not so easy. There's Tate. Come on, Lily! Egg hatching soon? Watch, the creature will be lost if you leave area. What egg? Did that female ostrich lay an egg? It laid an egg! What the heck am I gonna do with this? I don't- Why are you attacking me? Where'd the egg go? Guys, you attacked that ostrich! Okay, I have an ostrich egg now. That was unexpected. You guys didn't have to kill the mama ostrich. She was just doing what mama ostriches do. Attacking me, I guess. I don't know, I've never run into an ostrich in real life. And normally the males are the ones who take care of the eggs, so... They take- in fact, they take care of a whole harem. Ostriches are fascinating creatures. Oh well, at least we have one of their eggs now. Alright, good. Come on, Lily! Come on! That's right. Inside here. Oh, there's our other sheep! What the heck? Okay, no, Lily, move! Ugh. I guess it just- well, now we have two of all- all the creatures. So let's see what happens if I do this. Are you gonna make a baby? You gonna make a baby cow? Maybe? <gasps> baby cow! My first baby cow! Oh, that's so exciting! Damn it, Lily! I need that sheep in here, Lily! No, pick it back up! Don't let it escape! Okay, so yeah. Lily's shepherd herding skills need a little bit of work. Lily, get in here! Lily, quick! They're all escaping, Lily! No! No! Why is this so hard? Tate, dang it! Oh my gosh, this is just a mess. This is just a total mess. Over here, guys! Over here! Bring the, bring the nice wheat right over here, please! Dang it, Lily! Okay, come here. I know how I'm gonna fix this. Lily, sit. Oh yeah. Sit is my new most magical favorite word. This is how we fix this. This problem that we're having here. Apparently now we have a pig involved too. He was feeling left out. You guys, the barn isn't done yet! I can't- I can't have this chaos when I don't even have the barn completed. You're all invited to stay. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm not trying to chase you away. And where'd my first baby cow go? Dang it. That was my very first baby cow. And he's like gone. There's a rabbit. The rabbit wants in on this nonsense. There they are! Look, they're both here! They're getting lost in the poison ivy. Come on, guys. Come on. See, so we figured it out. Lily driving us nuts with her her misuse of her shepherd dog skills. All we have to do... I know, look at them all watch me. All we have to do is make her sit. And let us do the work. Come on, baby cow. Come on, baby cow. That's right. Oh, look! Sheepy sheeps. Sheepy sheeps. Have babies? Have babies? I see hearts. <gasps> baby sheepy sheep! More sheepy sheep babies! I want more! Nope, they're not doing it. They're saying, are you nuts? We just had a baby. You can't push us that hard. Okay, guys. Well, I'm gonna get out of here before a creeper gets here. Eh. Get your wool. Aww. Oops. 
All right, Lily, good girl. You can come now. <laughs> we did it! We have the very, the very beginning of our little farm. And the barn is going to come along now that we have some sheep cornered in a pen. Oh, that's so exciting. And Martha Jr. the second is here to keep Martha the first. Come on, come on, come on, Lily. Oh, well. Ah, all right. Time for snoozes and relaxation. And we have an ostrich egg that I need to go put in the egg crate or in my little egg spot. It was a very exciting, very exciting day. Let's see how all of our animals held up because I'm nervous about them being that far away from me. Are they all still there? Are they all still there? <gasps> They're still there! Victory! Victory! The farmyard is coming along excellently. Whew! Well, all right, guys. I'm going to hurry around, go take care of our garden somewhat, poke at this barn a little bit more, maybe try to separate the cows and the sheep from each other so that we can get the breeding going. There's our leather factory. There's our wool factory. We'll give them all names later. Whew. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.